I leave now, this afternoon, for an official working visit to Washington, D.C., the first in more than 10 years by a Philippine president. My visit is an important one, as they all are, because they are part of our efforts to further reinforce our already strong bonds with the United States by bringing our alliance into the 21st century. This visit builds on the active exchanges we have had, particularly in the last couple of months, which include my bilateral meeting with President Joseph Biden in New York last September, the visit to Manila of Vice President Kamala Harris last November, numerous visits by senior officials on both sides, as well as a two plus two ministerial meeting, which our Secretary for Foreign Affairs and Department of National Defense, OIC, attended barely three weeks ago. My visit to the United States, and more especially my meeting with President Joe Biden, is essential to advancing our national interest and strengthening that very important alliance. During this visit, we will reaffirm our commitment to fostering our long-standing alliance as an instrument of peace and as a catalyst of development in the Asia-Pacific region and, for that matter, the rest of the world. I intend to convey to President Biden and his senior cabinet officials that the president is determined to forge an even stronger relationship with the United States in a wide range of areas that not only address concerns of our times, but also those that are critical to advancing our core interests. These areas include food security, agricultural productivity, development, and digital economy, energy security, climate change, cybersecurity, as well as ensuring our resilience from threats to our economy, including global supply chain disruptions and economic coercion. Towards this end, one of my priorities for this visit is to push for greater economic engagement, particularly through trade and investment and science, technology, and innovation cooperation between the United States and the Philippines. I intend to speak and find opportunities in the semiconductor industry, critical minerals, renewable and clean energy, including nuclear and infrastructure projects that will improve our digital telecommunication systems and facilitate sustainability efforts to address climate change. As uh, with my visit to New York last year, I expect to meet with American business leaders to further promote trade and investment in the Philippines. The economic team and I shall be joined by key Filipino uh, private sector leaders in exploring business opportunities that would serve to grow our economy even more. While in Washington, I also look forward to meeting with our Filipino community who maintains strong ties to the Philippines despite being away for very many years, but continue to contribute towards the country's economic prosperity. Thank you very much. Wish us all the best of luck, and uh, we will see you when we get back. Maraming salamat. Magandang hapon sa ito.